Peace Sisters, I'm putting this video together to address something that I have seen that's quite popular in the goddess community, and it's something that I just, I do not agree with. It's this concept of forgiveness, that we have to forgive or allow or whatever to have freedom, to have healing, to be restored, to have the fullness of joy in our life. And I am a dark goddess. And I have to remind myself that though I am young, I am quite wise and quite old. And where I make my mistakes, where I have in my past, I don't do this shit anymore. But where I've made my mistakes in my past is looking at women older than me and expecting them to have wisdom. That's not always the case, and it's a very unfortunate truth. It is something that just grinds my gears, but it is what it is. And we have got to be honest that there are some of these struggle mammies on this planet who exist solely to help keep us stuck in this damn cycle. I don't like it. I don't stand for it. You all have heard me on the show. I do not stand for that. Diva does not represent that. So we're going to come together, and I have organized this class, The Art of Getting Even. I don't understand how anyone can call themselves a dark goddess and represent that concept of forgiveness as in you give it to someone else. That is not dark, nor is it wise. That is Christian. Give those people back their stuff. Give them back their stuff. I just I just cannot understand this, ladies. I don't know where it comes from. Well, I guess I do know where it comes from. Most of us came into God is through the church. And not all of us have let go of the church. What we did is we changed the gender of God. And that's it. We went from God the Father to God the Mother, but we're still Christian. You're not a goddess. That is not goddess. There's something so much more there. We have such a great fear of bitterness and anger, especially black women. And I see this a lot with us. Um, you know, I deal with us mostly and primarily. That is my focus. It's the focus of my work. But black women are so afraid of that word angry and that word bitter that they'll give up the right to be restored. If it just means no one can say that they're bitter. If it just means that people can look at them and say, oh, she's so sweet, she's so this, she's so that. And, but then you have all these experiences of those same people who look at you as so sweet and so nurturing and so giving, and they take and they take and they take, they give you nothing in return. And that is not spiritually based in truth. That is based in unwisdom. That's based in Christendom. That is not based in the dark goddess, that darkness upon the deep, dark wisdom, spiritual laws, and application of the same. And I'm not here to try to convince anybody, anyone who's signing up for this class, it is because you already are aligned with that truth. That forgiveness is not for you to give out to anybody. I did a show, I'm doing a show this evening actually. And I talked about this today. You will be doing it this evening at 6 p.m. But I, I'm going to be doing this show talking about why forgiving others curses you. And then after we do the show, I will make the class available to everyone. Of course, I'll be talking about it on the show. And it will be on our website as well. The Art of Getting Even. Because if you cannot hex, you cannot. You will not heal. This is not about running around here with a torch and a pitchfork or a battle axe. This is about standing on your own divine birthright of pleasure. And anything that should bring you displeasure, anyone who is displeasing, they have got to fix that. We cannot be walking around here wounded, ladies. This is why we're losing. I'd rather we win. Sign up for the class. We're going to talk about this and more. The description of the class is in the link. I look forward to seeing you both tonight at 6 p.m. on the radio and also in class. This is going to be a fire class. We're really going to, we're getting to the nitty gritty. We have got to grow up in goddess, as my mentor says it. Yes, it's time to grow up in goddess. Thank you for listening. I'll see you tonight on the show, and I'll see you this weekend in class. Peace be your journey. <laughs>